What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video of 7 Days to Die. This is my Stay Within series where I gotta stay inside a shopping mall and I need to survive. How are we doing? Hope you guys are well. Radio. so I wanted to break myself into the cinema complex. So we've just done that, which is awesome. And I just want to see what's what, loot the whole place up, see what we can get, and hopefully um, we'll have a great time. Now, if you guys didn't see the previous video, please check that out. We had so much going on in that last video, so much stuff that we had found. Um, I'm not going to spoil exactly on what I found, um, what happened in that video, but all I suggest that you guys need to do is please go ahead and check out that video because a lot of things went down. It was um, probably one of the, probably the video that's going to set up this series. So, um, with that being said, suss it out, guys. But check out this video. So what we're doing is we're just doing our usual bits and pieces, just checking out anything and everything and looting what we can, getting some seeds I've just noticed, so that's always a good thing. Um, been wanting to start doing the whole farm plantation side of things, but haven't had the opportunity or the chance um, to do just that. So haven't had um, that luxury just yet. Is that something I can loot? Um, I don't know if that's something I can loot. That looks like a false thing. So let's, um, oh no. Alright, um, well, this is going to break anyway. Right. That was a whole bunch of nothing, but, you know, what do you do? Uh, let's grab a few things here. I do hear some beating outside, so I don't know where that's coming from. And I'm guessing they're going to make their way in pretty soon. So we'll see how that sort of turns out but for now I'm just enjoying the free loot that I'm getting and as we sort of clear this oop, is that empty okay for some reason I thought anyway that is empty that is empty anything up here that I can take that is reinforced which I'm not going to bother about that's all glass and we're good all right let us move on. Uh, what's in here? Ooh. Okay, just some toilets. Get some toilet water, why not? No toilet pistol, but that's all good. Keep on keeping on and hang on to the to the lead that we just found just before. Um, anything over here? No, 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 no. Alright. Um, this is uh, another cubicle. Very good some more toilet water and a little bit more I tell you what as soon as I start cooking up this uh, this water turning into boiled water we're not gonna have any problems with uh, water supply I've got so much water now it's not funny I got a lot of empty glasses as well that I need to find a um, water reservoir so I can actually fill up um, a bit of water but not at the moment which I haven't found it oh that's what I was sort of that's what I was looking at but that seemed to be nothing anyway uh, that is some loot I can grab. That is nothing I can grab from there. Can I? Yes, I certainly can. Grab all the registered money. And a bit of everything. Very good. Okay. Alright, let's uh, make our way in here. Let's see how we can, how far we can get with this steel axe before it decides to uh, break on us. Yeah, we got through. We've got some moody glasses. Actually, am I wearing any of that right now? Uh, let's go. I am wearing. Oh, okay. Cool. Not too bad. So, what I've done so far at the moment is um, I've actually updated my um, uh, the Blood Moon. So, it is going to be 10 days as opposed to 7 days. Oh, oh. Alright, I hear someone. Sounds like you guys are outside. Yeah, sounds like, ooh, bacon and eggs. I can make bacon and eggs. Very nice. Uh, yeah, so day 10 Horde Night instead of day 7. Just to give me a little bit of a breathing space before we, um, does need repairs. Before we, um, decide to start making up our Horde base and things like that. I've got a couple of ideas on what I wanted to do. Um, I haven't really sort of nailed down on something that I want to do yet. And I'm thinking of a few things as well. And only because... I need to consider certain things um, when making my base. So um, I'm thinking about 
do I just do a straight up melee base? Am I looking at doing something a little bit different? Um, you know, am I going to involve myself with guns or weapons or things like that? I'm really not too sure. I'm in, in cupboard at the moment. Um, we are going to need to make a drop chest. Let's go ahead and scrap that. Uh, let's make a chest. Occupy that last spot that I have here. Right, well, I'm going to take that out because that's not going to be of any use to me right now. But what I can do is, I should be able to just drop it just over here. Just out of the way. Not a problem. There we go. And we'll just go ahead and drop everything that is not going to be... Ooh, I might just keep some food with us. But everything else here is not going to sort of help us out. I'll keep the wrench with me. Because uh, I don't have one on me at the moment. Don't know why, but anyway, it is what it is. Uh that and that and don't need any of that and I think I should be good very good yeah so um, horde night that's what was we're sort of discussing here don't know exactly what I want to do just yet so um, I'm thinking about a lot of things I'm not too sure what I really want to achieve with the horde base um, I have absolutely no clue um, melee base um, oh there's nice there's a few things in here that I can grab uh, yeah so don't know what they're all whether or not I want to use, you know, ammo, guns and things like that. I am getting um, an, a good amount of um, ammo, so I don't know how that's sort of going to work out. But if I make one base, I'm going to sort of try and speak, uh, stick to it. I don't know whether or not should I make some sort of modular base where I can make um, uh, a base for certain applications and then I can either add to the facts later on depending on what the, um, the situation may be for the next uh, Horde Knight, I'm not too sure yet. So, again, I'm just thinking of a few things on to what I can get, and I just got some pretty good loot. Um, yeah, that is insane. That is awesome. All right. Um, yeah. So, I'm not too sure yet. Let me know what you guys what you guys sh would like me to do. Should I do some sort of melee base? Should I do any sort of base just to sort of keep me alive? Or do you have something in mind? Um, that I could do that I could try out if you've got any sort of idea let me know um, give me a bit of a description on you know how to how to set up the base um, and yeah I'll see if I can work to it because right now I'm obviously on limited resources it's only day three I know it's a little bit early wow this is a very stubborn um, safe what the hell are you come on man come on come on behave really it's not going to be worth it when I open this thing up. I'm persistent and I'm just going to keep opening this thing up. How, mu how much lockpicks do I have left? Oh wow, I've only got two left. Come on. Come on. Honestly. It's not going to be worth it. <laughs> it was definitely not worth it. Definitely not worth it. I'm not going to be able to open up this. I don't know why I burnt all of that. Anyway. Um, it is what it is. Ooh, I've got a meat stew recipe. Very good. Um, I'll grab some of that. Um, okay, cool. We've got some books. Um, what do we have in here? Just paper. And the plastic cast. Alright, cool. Not bad at all. Very, very good. Uh, let's go ahead and just pop that in there and just leave that alone from thereafter yeah so not too sure what I want to do right um, just yet but I've got a few days I've got another full seven days before we have to sort of worry about that or you know when the night is upon us of course but I've got a decent amount of time and I feel like right now I've actually progressed quite quickly I feel within this series um, to actually worry about anything right just this minute but yeah it's just something I've been thinking about and hopefully, you know, I'll, I'll get a good idea and we can just sort of, you know, take it from there, I guess. But so far, um, I'm not going to worry about that. I shouldn't have to worry about that. That, that, is that. Ooh. Okay. What's up here? Okay. Literally, probably nothing, but... I'm going to suss it out anyway. Whoop. Is there anything up here? Anything at all? Hello? 
I picked the worst spot to actually um to jump up here. But anyway, let's just see if we can sort of do a peek around the corner. There is someone breaking something out there, and it's really annoying. Um, okay, cool. There's nothing there. Very good. Okay, Oop, I haven't seen these guys. Let's see what's in here. Open up this, and maybe this, and maybe that, and maybe that. All right, and that's another locked door. So let's um let's use this lock pick to open up the door. I can't believe I've burned through so much, so much lock pick. That was such a waste of time. That needs repairs. That is not a problem. Let's just continue on. And what I'm trying to sort of find out, is, well, find sorry, is um if there's any sort of open um you know oh, sorry accessible workstations um oh this is the other side oh that's getting a lot more um a lot more violent okay cool so they're actually coming from there so i'm going to start getting into a little bit of a combat mode um is this better than what i'm wearing yeah i'm not going to worry about that just yet i can use that for my reinforced club what i can do is you know what i'm just going to leave it here i haven't got the um, the capacity just yet to really look into that not yet but that's okay let's get out of that uh, let's go back into this and I'm definitely going to modify that into that okay that's going to be my big boy and uh, let's go ahead and see who has been trying to get themselves into well out of the cinema really hey buddy what's going on uh, this is your usher speaking. Do you have your ticket? Do you have your ticket? Yes or no? I guess you don't. Oop, out of stamina. Oop. That's right. Next time, have your ticket on you. Is there anyone else in here? Oh, he actually came from outside. Okay. Yeah. It took a while to try and get into me. Oh well. Hey buddy. What are you doing? Don't break my nice fence. Thank you. Actually, I really want to get up here. I really want to know what's up here and yeah. So I don't know if that's on the third floor, which I'm assuming that it is, but um, I haven't actually really taken any time to suss any of that out. I don't need anything here at the moment. I mean, this is a really good spot to basically loot anything and everything. So, yeah, that might be something that we could do later on. Ooh, what's in here? Nothing. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right, we'll um, continue on. That was Cinema 3 we were dealing with. Let's go to Cinema 2. Anyone in Cin uh, Cinema 2? Whoop, that's locked. Locked, locked. Alright, well, let's go ahead and open her up. See what's inside. See if there's any zombies inside, of course. And we'll just sort of go ahead and clear up stuff out. Come on. Here we go. Oh, okay. Got a couple of visitors. We've got a hole over there. Alright, that's going to be interesting. Okay, let's... Um, ooh. Oh, oh, alright, okay. Alright, sorry guys. Sorry for uh, disturbing uh, your movie session. But if you can come out in orderly fashion here, that'd be fantastic. Alright, hello. Let's just uh, move out a little bit. Hey, cheerleader. Whoop. Alright, alright, alright. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Just get some stamina back. Take you out. Oop, no more stamina. Okay. Okay, come on. Oop. Oh man, I've got no stamina whatsoever. Oh, well, there you go. Anyone around the corner? Around the corner? Hey, dude. I need water. Alright. Right, that should be a little bit better, hopefully. There we go. Thank you. 
All right, appreciate your um, your viewing experience. What's down here? Oh, all right. Let's um, let's not go down there just yet. Oh, we've got a bit of stone we can collect. Eh, may as well. May as well grab all that stone. And I don't think there's anything else for me here to look and see. No chests or anything. Oh, very lackluster, but that's alright. That was the same cinema. Yes, it is. Okay. And on to cinema one. Let's see who is in cinema one. But, ooh, there's something in here too. I reckon let's just open up this first before we get under there. Get underway, of course. Anywho. Alright, so how are you guys all doing at the moment? Uh, with Considering with what's going on inside, um, outside the world there, I think I left it long enough so I may not get, um, you know, mon uh, demonetized or anything like that or blocked on, on the old YouTubes, but um, how are you guys holding up? Um, let me know in the comments, uh, with all seriousness, of course. So, um, ooh. Oh, alright, cool. I've got the Taz's Stone Axe. That's a better Stone Axe than... Oh, hell yeah. Alright, um... I'm gonna use that moving forward. Very good. Uh, yeah, so, it's been absolutely crazy with what's happening, you know, ar across the world, around the world, everyone has, um... It's very unprecedented, something that no one has ever sort of experienced before, um... So... I hope we never actually experience this again, but it's... I think, you know, in these sort of times, we just got to make sure that we're looking after ourselves, um, loved ones, everything else in between. Um, for me, you know, I'm doing I'm doing fine. I'm actually still going to work. My uh, my place of business is um, is very essential, um, so we do need to stay open. I'm still actually travelling and commuting into work via uh, via pub, uh, public transport. It's the most efficient way for me to actually get in. I know it may not be the the most safest uh, way to get in, but it is something that I'm just still doing at the moment, so we haven't been told to start working from home. So the the systems and processes that I need to do, I need to be at work basically, and that's where where it's at at the moment. But um, for me, that's that's pretty much where I'm at with things at the moment. So uh, let me know how you guys are holding up. What are you guys doing? Are you guys uh, at home? Are you guys still at work? Are you guys working from home, schooling from home? Uh, what's the go? Let me know. Um, just want to make sure you guys are okay. Just touching in, and yeah, hopefully you know we'll, we'll somehow get through this um, sooner rather than later. I hope. Um, that's the ability to find more brass. That's good. Um, learn how to never run out of bullets again. Okay, cool. Um, all well and good, but I really need um, uh, what do you call it? I need coal. That's what I need. Um, let's just get rid of all of that. I won't need any of that. Very good. I'll leave that there for now. I will collect it later on. Um, but right now, where are we? This is back to level one. I might spend some time in the second floor today, actually. So let us go over here. Or is this. Uh, no, I think this is going to make me go up to the roof. So let's not do that. Let's just keep moving along and get out of here, of course. Lock her up, and yeah, let's go up to level two. One up. I haven't spent any time up in level two properly. Did go up to um, level three, but again, you guys need to check out the the previous video for that one there. Um, you know what? Let's go to the candy store. What's in the candy store today? Um, ooh, did I? Was that what? Okay, okay, that must have been um, from the bottom, I guess, where I was, I don't know. Anyway, let's see what we can get. Oh, we've got some honey, that is really good, just in case if I get infected. It's the last thing I want. This has got to be like a... Okay, so that's sand. If I get a shovel, or if I make a shovel, that might be something that I'll probably be uh, you know, starting to loot, I guess, but oh, nothing in there. Um, there's really nothing in here. Um, just a lot of sandbags here. Okay, well, what happens if I break this? Is it just going to break open? Okay. 
Cool. Nothing. Nothing at all. Alright, well, that was a boring experience. This doesn't even work. I can wrench it, but I think I'm going to hold off on wrenching things um, as much as possible. Just so I can get my um, uh, salvage operations up to a, a suitable level for me to start wrenching things down. Just so I can make the most out of my... Um, um, you know, wrenching up uh, things like iron and whatnot. So, yeah, I'm just going to see if I can hold off as much as I can before I have to do that. But we'll see how we go. Oh, there's got to be something in here. Come on. Needs to be something in here. A wooden chair. There's got to be something ab above, I guess, maybe. Anything? Really? There's nothing. And there's nothing there, there's something there. Alright, what's in here? Uh, what do we have in here? Okay, we've got a pine cone, we've got some wood. Not getting as much as I would like. Oh, okay, I didn't notice all of this up here. Okay. Maybe all is not lost. Let's um let's just keep sussing this out. A lot of bullets. Bit of oil. A uh, bit of bullets. Uh, Alright, some ammo. And what have we got over here? Yeah, some more ammo. Okay, well, alright, look. I take it back. I'm sorry. Alright, let's move on to the next place. What, what have we got here? Jeans. I'm getting encumbered again. Alright, uh, uh, let's make another storage chest. Where did you go? Where's, there you are. Alright, I'm just going to take that for there and let's just put you there. Very good. And let's get rid of all these things that I'm not going to. Uh, do I want the BDU bottoms? Yeah. No, I don't want that. Don't want that. Don't want that. All that. All this can go for now. Um, Take all of that away. We've got so much stuff at the moment. Um, I'll leave that there. Actually, I'll pop you there. All right, very good. All right, let's see what. Okay, let's prepare you. Should have no. You should have done that a little bit sooner. But anyway, um, what have we got in here? Ooh. All right. I thought that was going to be like another um, another. Uh, singing chest that would have been cool but that doesn't matter we've already got the one night stalker what is this blades don't matter if it, if it cuts blade weapons do 10 percent more damage all right well that's nice nothing in there nothing in over here okay okay cool all right um What's over here? This is a uh, fancy. Oh, what's so fancy about this place? Is there anything I can loot? Okay, well, for a fancy shop, there is only one garment bag. So we've got a little flannel top there. There we go. You know what? I might just wear that. Yeah, scrap that because I'm definitely not going to need that anymore. Um, why? Oh, okay. Couple bags here. Really, really not much here to write home about. Anyway. Okay, don't worry about that. Oop. Let's go over to RJ. And see what RJ has to offer me here today. Anything? Um. Nothing. Lockpicks, good. Alright, let's just get a few more lockpicks. Because I really want to get into those safes upstairs, but now I'm worried because I blew all my lockpicks before at the beginning of the video, so that's a bit of a major concern, but you know, just take that with me anyway. Um, anything else? Anything else? I'm just going to grab all these because I really don't want to come back later on. Um, very good. 
Okay, so we've got RJ, we've got Reach. So these two here, uh, sorry, Mr. Reach. Both two, these two guys are YouTubers. Um, they are great at what they do. Their streams are amazing. If you guys have any time on your hands, if you want to see a few of their streams, um, any of their videos, please check them out. They are actually really good YouTubers. Uh, good people to chat to as well. Spoke to Reach a, a couple of times on occasion. So yeah, um, if you guys are interested, definitely uh, check them out. All right, what have we got over here? Uh, nothing over here. What did I get? Uh, scrap boots. I think I might wear those. Yeah, all right. A little bit better than what I have at the moment, so uh, why not? All right. Oop. Oh, do I do it? How much lockpicks do I have? I've got seven. I'm here. Let's just see how we go. And... If I open this up, we'll, we'll call this a video, of course. If I run out, we'll definitely call this a video, and I'll um, I'll go away and cry somewhere, of course, if I can't open up this bloody lock. Come on. Behave. I, th I, I don't think I have any... I don't have any points into lock picking. I, I get it. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah. You know what? I still got all of my points available, too, so... I really should just invest in one. Oh, my God. Come on. Oh come on, don't 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 do this to me. Thank you. Still wasn't even worth it, and I've got one lock pick left. Thank you very much. Ooh, I didn't realise there was a camera here. Ooh. Alright, alright, cool. This must have been some sort of media broadcasting thing when, you know, the whole apocalypse ha happened. Um fair enough. Um alright, so that's pretty much it guys, so Looks like we um, got some more looting to do, of course. Thank you, Mr. Reach and RJ there for that one. Um, we've got the Apple Store. So that's cool. Well, I think we'll go ahead and suss that out in the next video there. So look, if you guys did end up enjoying the video, make sure you hit the like button. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about the series so far. Um, be sure to hit the notification bell and subscribe if you haven't, guys. Um, if you want to check out any future videos that I'm playing, um, yeah, it would be a good time. Anyway, uh, take it easy and catch you next time.